Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Serendipity by Melanie. Happy Saturday everybody. I'm going to be doing two premieres, 30 minutes each, and I sell in Canadian funds, so if I ask $15, that's like $12 US. I ship from Western Canada, and the prices vary, depends on where you're at. I don't feel that the shipping is too, too bad, um, but it does get a little expensive if I'm shipping to uh, Eastern Canada. That's the expensive piece there. But for the U.S., I don't find the shipping that bad. Don't forget to be in live chat instead of top chat, and if you find that you're lagging a little bit, set your speed to 1.25 and it'll help you catch up. So some friends dropped off some stuff for me to their, uh, you know, just fall cleaning out their cupboards kind of things. So I'm going to start with these insane, beautiful salt and pepper shakers. Look at these. They're huge. They're so nice. Look at these. A little bit of tarnishing. I'll give you a measurement because they're like five inches tall or something. They're really nice. Um, six inches tall. Like I say, they're large. Here's the bottom. They're in great condition. So for the pair of these is $12, number 93. $12, number 93. Aren't those great? Tempting, tempting to keep them. So what else do I have? Oh, I have this hen on a nest. This is from Madam Rack. And it is clear glass. Needs a bit of a wash. And on the bottom I see a G. Could be a C. So for the hen on the nest, sorry, two hands here. This hen on the nest is $12. Number 27. Madam Rack. $12. Number 27. I'm just putting it in a safe place. More dust. Sorry, you guys. So this is ceramic. It holds your rings. Isn't it cute? I have one in purple. And I'll give you a measurement on it. It is five inches long by three and a half inches high. So for this, it is four dollars, number 45. Four dollars, number 45. Cute. Very girly. I have these three ornaments here. They are ceramic. They're just little teapots. Here's the top. They are just one piece. They do not open. So here's one. This one looks like there's a bit of paint loss on the rim here. I can barely feel it, so I think they call that a flea bite. But this is a sewing machine on top. There's the bottom. So I'm selling all three as a group. Here's the last one, the teapot on the stove top. Just so cute little ornaments. So for the three of these, it's going to be $7, number 34. $7, number 34. I like them. I had them up for a while. I've had them probably six years. And then, I don't know, for if you look on Pinterest, you can see about... Uh, repurposing baby shoes. These are the hard bottoms. Whoops, 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 dropping things. So for the baby booties is 
They're vintage for sure. Hard to find. Four dollars, number 17. Four dollars, number 17. I was going to paint them. Oh, and I went to the baby shower last Sunday. It's a piece of metal that fell. Last Sunday, I went to the baby shower, and last night, the little girl was born. Uh, her name is Daisy Rain, but I'm not sure her weight or anything like that. I just uh, seen the post that she's here, so that's pretty cool. So this is what just tipped over. It is um, rose gold color. I've used it a couple of times. It's just not big enough for, like, I drink Diet Dr. Pepper, and it's just not big enough for me. So I love it, though. It is brand new. I used it maybe four times. So for this is $4, number nine. $4, number nine. Rose gold. Just finding little things. This is a beautiful teacup. And on the bottom it says Royal Staffordshire Bone China, made in England, established in 1845. This is my teacup. It is quite expensive for this teacup. But I'll let it go for $15, number 72. $15. Number 72. I just love the pinks and the mauves. I had it in my kitchen until last week. I bought this online. It's also something a bit small for me. These are great for orange juice for breakfast. I only have the one honeycomb pattern on it. I'm not sure if it's Hazel Atlas or I'm not sure. There's nothing on the bottom except 8-9. And those show somewhere, but it's so cute. I love the colors. So this is $5, number 56. $5 for this vintage glass, number 56. Here's an earring holder. It's about four inches and it stands on its own. So you just put your earrings through there. This is a vintage piece, rhinestones. So this is $3, number 78. $3, number 78. And I'll call it in the chat. A friend of mine asked me to sell this and it says, when in doubt, let your horse do the thinking. <laughs> That's so true. I believe it's made in China because the sticker on the back says China. But it's in excellent condition. So for this is $3, number 24. $3, number 24. I had to do that once going over a mound and I was just on my pony, like um, my Shetland Welsh pony and there was other horses coming and the riders and I was going over this mound and I thought I'm just going to let her take me where we need to go because it was insane. There was just so much going on and she was going at a fast speed. So yeah, it was pretty funny. I was probably only eight. This says Liverpool Road Pottery Limited, Noritake on Trent, I think, and it still has its hanger on it, nice vivid colors. I'll let you read the back. I believe that says Noritake right there, not 100% sure. But it's very pretty. She's got wheat in her arms, the dog, and it says, Cries of London, who will buy my lavender? Oh, I guess she's selling lavender. And it's written just down here, Cries of London. 
So for this, it is $4, number 13. $4, number 13. What else? Oh, I have these Moose Jaw Saskatchewan salt and pepper shakers. There's the back. They still have their sticker on them. One is missing the stopper on the bottom. Let me just read it. I'll put one down. Saskatchewan Corbic completed. Mm. Swiss current Saskatchewan. Sorry, I. It's just hard to read it when it's this age. But for these, the set here is $7, number 51. $7, number 51. They've been removing these grain elevators um, at a fast rate, so we're losing them here in Canada. And it, yeah, they're part of our heritage, my belief. So it is hard to see when they take them down. So here's some pottery. I don't see any markings on the bottom, but it's a cream and sugar. Perfect, perfect for this time of year. So the cream and the sugar, there's no handle. Here's the bottoms. But they are pottery. I'll show you the inside. It's a beautiful day here. It's early, so it's a little cool out. But for this set, it is $8, number 5. $8 for the pottery, cream and sugar, number 5. So perfect. At this time of year, I have this teapot. It's the see-through silver tone lid. I'm not sure if there's no marking, so it is but it does have the latches to hold the lid tight. It fits very well. It needs a cleaning. And I would imagine this is four cup. I'm just going to measure. It's about five inches high by five wide. And this is uh, $6, number 86. $6, number 86. And it is glass. Oh, I love this. I bought this off somebody else's bid site or um, YouTube sale. Holiday Imports Tarnish Protected Silver Plate. Do not use polish cleaning with damp cloth. Will retain luster. Made in Japan. It's a salt with its scoop this and it has nice weight to it this is beautiful nice metal I'll show you the bottom isn't that insane so it has the one handle and then the top handle and the scoop so for the pair of these, it is $16, number 41, $16, number 41. I paid probably $25 for it, but it's beautiful, you guys. Beautiful. So I have the stack of um, saucers here, and I just um, opened up the tape on the top one. Royal Majestic Fine China Door D comma O R eight four oh four China So I believe there's six one two three four five six seven oh one two three four five six seven of them so for these it is four dollars number forty three 
four dollars number 43 and they're in excellent condition hmm hmm where do I put things this is um, a snuggie so it keeps you warm and your hands free so I'll just show you this side so you wrap it around you put your arms through it's great I don't know if it's been used it's from my best friend I don't have to ship it in the box I can ship it without the box so as seen on TV from Bed Bath & Beyond $20 at the top corner up here Bed Bath & Beyond so for this it is eight dollars number 55 eight dollars number 55 I have one in red they're so cozy <clears throat> I should say snuggy sorry <laughs> And, oh, I have a few of these. The box is a bit dented from being in storage. Classic collectible, my treasure shoes, hat, and purses. So this is a shoe here. I'll give you the measurement of just the shoe. It is about four inches wide. Or long, sorry, four inches new in box so for this it is five dollars number 52 five dollars number 52 and then I have another one this is like I say the box has a little dent and it's the black um, it has like the faux gold zipper on the front of the boot. So this is five dollars number four. Five dollars number four. I have this beautiful lampshade and I'm going to measure it. Ten inches high and it is probably 10 wide. It is wooden, so here's the top of it. But look at this. I wish I had a lamp that went with it. Isn't it beautiful? And this is material. Like, oh my God, it's so beautiful. Lightweight. Considering its age, it's in excellent, excellent condition. Oops. So this is $15, number 40. 10 by 10. $15, number 40. I just love it. I've had this thing for, oh, can't even tell you. I would say eight years, and I still haven't used it, so time to let it go, right? Here's another set of salt and pepper shakers. They're small. They do have their stoppers from Japan. I'll just show you the tops and then I'll hold one. Just quaint little flowers. There's a little manufacturer's defect on this one. It's like a chunk of the ceramic. These are like bone china feel to them. So these are $4, number 26. $4, number 26. And I'll call it in the chat. I was mentioning that I was going to have the one fairy light. I did buy it off somebody's YouTube channel. It is opaque with the roses, very simple. I like the simple designs. I'm just gonna run my hands around it because it's been in storage. No, it's in great shape. This is the hobnail 
part of the base. There's the bottom. But the simplicity of it, I love this one. They are quite collectible, and Trisha is really scored on a big bundle of them. So she has them up for sale. So this one is $15, number 76. Very good price. $15, number 76. Because I don't do the offer ups, because I do premiers, I just kind of make it fair. I don't feel comfortable with that there. Right there. So what else do we have? I have some yarn. A multi-pack. Never been opened. And let me read it. There are, it's love painting, it says on that piece of paper. Um, jewelry, making art, lots of colors. Two, four, five, two, four. There's 20 pieces in it. I'm just trying to see. Rayline Do, pack of 20, yarn with three crochet, new. So there must be three crochet hooks in here. So for this bundle of 20 is going to be $18, number 89. $18, number 89. I love the colors. This, these ones over here. Ugh. Yarn is so expensive, it's crazy. I'm going to do a measurement before I show you this little planter. It is about two inches high and two and three quarters inches wide. It's so cute. It says, Patent Pending Opco, Zanesville, USA. So I'll show you the back where all the writing is. And the bottom. I don't see any markings there. On the inside, it has been used, but the flower's in excellent condition. So for this little planter, very vintage. $6, number 37. $6, number 37. That's a pretty blue I don't see often. Okay, so I have this tin here. It says Williamson Tea, tea farmer since 1869. Look at the colors. That elephant is beautiful. And there is a small ding on the lid here. There's the lid. There's the bottom. And I'll take the lid off. The inside is in excellent condition. Just that little ding at the top here. His little tail at the seam here. <laughs> and I'll give you a measurement on the size of it. Um, six and a half inches high and approximately four wide. So for this elephant tin is going to be eight dollars number sixty six. Eight dollars number sixty six. Love the colors. There. And I bought these off someone's YouTube channel. channel. They're Andrea by Sedek, made in Thailand. But Andrea by Sedek is very, very good. So the teapot at the top, and it's like a soup spoon. And then these two, so I'm selling them all together. So all three of them for $8, number 44, $8, number 44, and they all have their stickers, Andrea by Sadiq. There's those ones. I'm just checking the time. Okay, I have a few more minutes. So I have two of these. This is the large canister, vibrant navy blue, 
the plastic lid says on the bottom Carlton glass three liters USA so this one is three liters and this one is one liter it does have a bit of wear somewhere oh on these ducks on the back just a bit of wear here other than that they're in excellent condition so a three liter and a one liter so for the pair of these is going to be twelve dollars number fifty twelve dollars number fifty and I'll call it in the chat I have this little plant pot with the opalescent on the rim. I believe it will hold, it's five inches tall and four inches wide at the ring. So then there's a little more to make it a, a little wider for a four inch pot. And it's just such a pretty opalescent. And the bottom doesn't have any holes in it. But like I say, it has been used. So for this 4-inch pot holder, it is going to be $3, number 59. $3, number 59. Just love the opalescent. And a little bit of space needed here. I have this vintage purse. It has a single handle. Oh, look at these beads. This is in really, really good condition. And the handle, um, there's a few beads. You can see them protruding here. But the handle is just single. And I had it hanging. And the inside is clean. It says handmade in Hong Kong. But it's very clean on the inside. And it does have a zipper. But like I say, in excellent condition, except a few beads protruding here on the handle. Right on this side. So that is the back side of the purse. But look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So for this, it is $16, number 46. $16, number 46. And I'll call it in the chat. I have another one. It's like a velvety. And then, oops, a little bit of dust with the blue applique on it and the fringes. And it has the rope hanger. You can make it to the length that you want. And the back is just simple like velour, velvet, I'm not sure. It is lined on the inside and it's just so clean on the inside as well. A zipper at the top, a zipper at the side, and like I say, like it's never been used. For this one, it is $12, number 21. $12, number 21. And I have a couple more I'll probably put in the next video. So I'm going to end this one here so that I'm not overlapping into the next one. So I'll see you in a minute, you guys. Beat me in the chat. Bye-bye.